to do the same. Earlier today, roughly a dozen community groups launched a coalition for the 2030 Olympics, and Utah is still in the running to host the Games. This could be the second time the capital city would host the world. Morgan Saxon explains how these groups are now hoping to help the city fight for that spot. We are nearly a decade away from the 2030 Winter Olympics, and today local groups got together to get a head start on the conversation. A coalition including labor, environmental, and community groups got together for about half an hour to launch their idea of strengthening Salt Lake's bid as a host. They've drafted a document based on what worked and didn't work when Salt Lake hosted the Games in 2001. City leaders found out almost a year ago Utah is being considered as a place to host the Games. Since the announcement in December, these groups have put together an initiative to increase the chances of being selected. The partners have put together a benefits agreement for the city, which includes renovated housing, employment opportunity, and investment in transportation suitable for greater use and attention to air quality. There are no specifics stated in this vision nor an estimated cost for these changes. However, they have spoken with bo both mayoral candidates for the city and hope their vision provides easy and affordable accessibility to the games. In Salt Lake City, Morgan Saxton, 2 News.